Tis you who art blessed by the princessin. Oh. Have I captured your undivided gaze? <laughs> There's no helping it, I suppose. Oh no. Pose. Don't do this to me. Very well. I shall grant thine eyes permission to behold the glory that is the princessin. Main Fräulein says oh. she's happy to see you. A blazing Freaking star nice. creeps into the sky, seeking to usurp the rightful Amen. territory of the Immanachreich. <sighs> Tis futile. Verily, my realm shall descend upon warm and dis... Why is it buffering? Oh, this is going to be something else. Seas. That is to say, a certain remote and mysterious corner of the seas has received many visitors recently. Duster away. Big Oz. Only fate shall decide. My loyal subjects, prepare to witness the glorious revival of the Imanakrish at the hand of the Princess Endeavor Ertelung. As you behold go back? the image woven by fate. In other words, well. Why? Why is it buffering? It's going ruining the, my immersion. The Kitchen Impact version 2.8 special program. <laughs> Sit back, relax, and prepare to watch our version. That's not Oz. This is killing me. Why is it doing this? Why? 2.8 trailer. Oh, that was a cool intro. If I could have actually. Oh shoot! Hold on. Have you ever met someone by the name of Kaidahara Kazuha? Oh my god, bro. Why? 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 Should be no reason this buffer. He was called away earlier by some people from the Tenryo Commission. They said they had something important to discuss with him. Bro, this is this is insane. What is going on? Is it on my end? Why is it buffering so much? I no longer have any grounds to officially arrest him. Then again, I guess something very interesting is about to happen. Bro, can I even watch this stream? What is That's going it. on? I'm taking this case over. Yeah. Ooh. Oh my God, bro. Uh, pressure. Can't move it. Dang. It has some range on him. It's insane. Why is this doing this so much? When I touched the hilt for the first time, it's as if I was transported to a strange dimension. Oh, faithful retainer. What the heck is this? Bro, my streams are just awful. Like, really? What is going on? Why? This is the blessed paradise that one has been searching for. Bro, what is Here this? Is where we shall witness the culmination of all things. I, who commands the darkness, shall lead you to yonder gate of dreams. Is this like Fashil's like domain? What's going on? Also, dude, this is ridiculous. I don't know if that was was that some room? Oh, right. Praise be to the princess who has led us here to this site. Join you on this trip, your highness. Look at me, a genius. Bro, what is going on? This astrologist forced into a this astrologist forced into a juvenile role-playing game. Lady Magi This is like a not even watchable. Do we need like a restart or something? What's this? Are you embarrassed? Stop calling me that weird name. Lady Majig. I can't even. Hold on. What is going on here, man? Like, I don't even understand why this is happening. Is it, can this is also on YouTube or is this all on Twitch? <laughs> excellent. Most excellent. Oh, official. Oh my god, I'm about to watch this again. What is going on? Is this on YouTube? Also? Like, I don't know why Twitch is having... Oh, you're having it too? 
So it's not just me. Oh, there's your first code. Hey everyone, welcome again to the Genshin Impact version 2.8 special program. I'm your host, Zach Aguilar, the voice. The voice of what? I don't want to check if anyone like ticks on this one right now. She, I of might. Ether. Okay. And as always, I'm excited to be joined by some very special guests. <laughs> Hi, oh, she I'm Brittany Cox, Cox, voice official, Princess and Dova Ertalang. Hello, everybody. I am Mark Witten, the voice of Kaidahara Kazuha. And Oz? Um, ben, you there? Hey, what's up, everyone? I'm Ben Pronsky, the voice That's of funny. official's feathery familiar Oz. And uh, as you can see, I'll be serving as a special. Bro. <laughs> Why? Oh my gosh. They need to just restart. Just restart. Hit the restart Fishing button. For today's program. Uh, I'm going to leave most of the talking to you guys, but, you know, I'll still chime in every now and then. You're so cute. <laughs> Good awesome. luck, man. This cause was so, lunch. <laughs> uh, first things first, as everyone saw in the trailer, we've got some serious island vibes happening in version 2.8. Yes. Yeah, we do. So cool. In fact, the stories of these islands are closely connected with each of the characters shown here. Mm. That's right. And so to match the beautiful island vibes, there's also an island-themed preview this time around. Ooh. Ooh. Let's have a look. So down to the stream, the first thing I hear is, I'm, I'm pissed, chat. <laughs> yeah, so, okay, I'm glad it's not just me. God dang. Why, man? Yeah, he, yeah, I saw that. He was drinking, yeah, cryo slime. Was that? Yeah, it was cryo. Oh, this is so pretty. I love all the colors. Indeed. We've definitely got a lot to cover. So, where would you guys like to dive in? <laughs> nice. Oh, <man>. Wow. <laughs> well, nice. Uh, why don't we start from the left? And uh, I'm totally... Get myself over here real quick. What in the world, man? Why is this so scuffed? Oh, look, you, you wake up just to, to check this out, and then Kazuha this there. happens. So I swear. Sure, keep telling yourself that, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this bubble oh, contains it's a screenshots from Kazuha's upcoming story quest. So I want to talk about this floating purple sword it looks so cool i mean fischl loves mm -hmm. purple i love purple <laughs> i just need to know more yeah and i think the sword looks kind of worn and beat up so uh it's like a beat up not sure if i have a good feeling about this one <laughs> yeah who knows who knows <gasps> all good observations i wish i could tell you more but i am sworn to secrecy <laughs> it's also pretty ominous <laughs> tell us <laughs> no i cannot Okay, okay Twitter rage already. <laughs> Next screenshot. <laughs> Next screenshot, yeah. indeed. Next screenshot. Successor uh, of Ishin okay. Art, Kaidahara Kazuha, honored to cross blades with you. Who's that? Okay, Serena interesting. NPC? I mean, I love a good duel. Yeah, me too. And it seems like it's an important fight. That was a pretty formal sounding intro. Uh, That's for an NPC. sure. I mean, do we have any idea who this opponent is? Hmm. Yeah, it's hard to say. I think the bigger be question anybody. is why Kazuha's in a duel to begin with. Like, hmm. He's not typically the kind of guy who's out looking for fights. Uh, I wish I could tell you, but I can't. These are all fantastic questions. So travelers, yeah, be prepared it. to check out all the details when the story quest is live. And we still have one more screenshot, I think. Sweet. Hello, Purple 2, Purple Supremacy. Oh, it's a free sword. Oh, shoot. What mm, the heck? What is going on here? Well, what Kazuha's the heck? eyes are glowing purple. I mean, if it was Fischl, I mean, purple would be fine. <laughs> and it looks like he's forging a blade with a hammer here. Yeah, and, and I don't know if you noticed. It's like but infused the with the animal. It looks like it's glowing with animal power. Yeah. Some travelers might remember that Kazuha is from a family of swordsmiths and that his clan was one of the Raiden Gokuden, which were the renowned swordsmith clans in Inazuma. So maybe he's decided to take up the art of forging now? Anyway, what? Kazuha looks uh, pretty uh, serious, so it's got to be something pretty important happening here. This is a here. sword. Oh, I can't help but feel a little worried for him. I mean, I hope he'll be all right. Well, one thing I can say is that with the traveler by his side, I'm sure we'll be in for an exciting ride. 
Excited. Rhymes. That rhymes. <laughs> <laughs> Been spending too much time with Kazuha. Sorry, it's in my. You're it's in a my, poet. It's in my veins. <laughs> Unfortunately, <laughs> that's all we can share for now. The version oh, update will over. be featuring Act One of Kazuha's all-new story quest, Acer Palmatum Chapter. I can't wait <laughs> for travelers to dig deeper into the story with Kazuha. Yeah. What's up, Gobi? And this bubble also contains info on another character appearing in version 2.8. That's right. Mm. Here we have Kazuha's good buddy, fellow Animo Vision holder, and renowned Tenryo Aizo. detective Shikanoin Heizo. Oh, so they're buds. Mm. Sweet. Indeed. Yeah, um... Uh, he's adorable. <laughs> right, there he is. Check it out, he's got those determined Punching man. eyes. Look at that wry mm. smile. Total detective. <laughs> He looks That's cool. pretty cool. He's ready to battle. Nice and breezy for Animo. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta keep cool when you're fighting, man. You do, you do. True. Looks, like, looks like they fixed Heizo it for the most part. Kazuha are buds. I think we can let Mark introduce Hazo for us. I would love to. Hazo has quite the reputation and is the center of many stories circulating around Inazuma, which is no surprise, given that the police station's jail is crammed with criminal masterminds yep. who are all tracked down and the caught posters. by Hazo. So you could say that he is a genius crime solver, and as a detective, it's Hazo's hope that his name would spread all across Inazuma. Though that kind of yeah. sound like he's all about chasing fame, his real ambitions come from his views about crime. Okay, so what do you mean by that? Yeah, I'm glad you what asked. What do you Zach. mean by that? <laughs> <laughs> uh, though he has this uncanny crime solving skills the vast majority of the work as a detective happens only after a crime meaning that the pain and the damage of the crime is already looking like at a sword but i guess not, not always reversible to hazo you only become a true detective when your reputation is strong enough to make a person think twice before committing a crime for fear of being caught that's when the role of a detective has really overcome the power of crime and is preventing yeah, ah, cases just rather than only cleaning That's up freaking the awesome. aftermath. That is so fancy. <laughs> I mean, you gotta hand it to him. Absolutely, and with these ideas in mind, Hazo has even refused promotions because he wants to stay close to the crime scenes. Wow. He believes his place is on the front line. So for outsiders, it looks kind of unfair that such a talent should stay at the bottom of the ladder. Uh, Hazo's Where have you been, Hizo? Kano Nana has always thought that he deserved to be promoted for his work. Yeah, I can totally get why she feels his, that way. Mm -hmm. Oh, speaking of detectives, I bet Hazo knows Detective Sango too, right? Yes, he does. In fact, uh, Sango and Hazo oh, have collaborated. Oh, I know. In remember past, Sango? But let's just say they ended up going their separate ways. Mmm. It sounds like mm. Hazo is kind of like a lonely prodigy that sticks to his own ideals. I like that. <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> I like that too. Very moody there, yeah. But mm -hmm. he's not all it's that like a lonely. Depends I mean, on he the does have Kazuha yeah. as a friend. The one. Right. <laughs> so how did the two of them meet? Oh, that's well, fine. Kazuha man. has helped Hazo in the past using his attunement to nature. And with Hazo's sharp intuition, I guess you could say that there's a sort of a natural understanding between the two animo wielders. Mm. Oh, and you shouldn't forget Kujo Sara either. She thinks pretty highly of Hazo. Getting Kujo Sara's approval Sara. definitely can't be easy, so I guess that's saying something about Hazo. Yeah, well, to be honest, even though Sara acknowledges Hazo's abilities, I think his tendency to not follow rules and roam about freely draws her sharp tongue more often than not. Oh. After all, Hazo has his own way of doing things, and he's never in the office on time and Dang. taking care of his <laughs> daily responsibilities at the station. Instead, he's always off somewhere investigating. It's back scenes with that uh, smirky face so <laughs> you can only imagine what kind of headaches a subordinate like him would cause for a serious leader like kujo sara okay okay poor sara yeah. man I god dang the picture now <laughs> you know i'm sure whatever he lacks in boring office work he makes up for with his combat abilities so why don't we talk about that let's take a look at hazo oh, in go. action let's do it yeah there's the buffering that's mihayo something in the air Something that tells me a new case is brewing. What was that? The quills? Oh my god, it's so blurry. Oh, dude. Alright. Alright, this does look pretty cool, though. Ooh. Damn. 
Dang. I gotta admit, it looks sick. I cannot knock that. Those moves are incredible. He makes Everyone's getting down on their knees, Frank. <laughs> there we don't get any worse. This move set. <laughs> wow, he's cool. We're asking and for buffing. Voice. Yep, that was we me. got buffer. I mean, he's so cool, confident, and mysterious. I love it. Right, really sleuthy, yeah? Okay, so jumping this right in, cool. Shikano Inhezo wields a catalyst and carries an animo vision. Interesting. He's like a melee catalyst user, right? We've never even seen this before. No, nope. it's super cool. Well, and some Hezo of us have. inherited his fighting style and knowledge from his dad. But in reality, Hazo prefers to use his mind rather than his physical strength hmm. and restrains from using force whenever possible. Well, that makes sense. Right. I don't want to jump to conclusions. However, when investigating criminal cases, there will always inevitably be some criminals who won't go down without a fight. The voice is Hazo is unhappy whenever he's really? faced with such moments, but he definitely knows how to put his agile skills to good work on the battlefield. And in addition to his normal and charged attacks, his elemental skill is also an unarmed technique. Something cool about Hazo's elemental skill is that yeah. it can be held for a charging effect, which will grant him special declension stacks. Ooh. Oh, Once I didn't even see that. Hazo reaches a certain amount of declension stacks, his elemental skills damage and AoE increase, which will definitely impact the fight in a big way. Hmm. Sounds like trying to outsmart Hazo is Kazo? probably a bad really? idea. Yeah. Oh yeah. I Me, mean, does look pretty Not cool. Not a good one at all. When Hazo's opponents try to make a break for it and yeah. scatter in all directions, Hazo will unleash his wind muster kick, leaping into the air and kicking something called a Fudo-style vacuum slugger towards his enemies. Ooh. The vacuum slugger will explode upon impact, dealing AoE animo damage and creating a vacuum that pulls in nearby opponents in traditional animo style. Mm. Also, when the vacuum slugger hits yeah. opponents affected by hydro, pyro, cryo, or electro, it causes a delayed follow up explosion, dealing damage of the corresponding oh. elemental type. That's nice. Mm. Okay. Yeah, I really like how his burst has that delayed explosion effect. I like Just that. when you think it's over, boom. Catalyst gene. <laughs> <laughs> no clue here. And finally, with Hazo's guidance, he decreases sprinting stamina consumption for other party members, allowing your team to catch even the swiftest of yes. criminals without breaking a sweat. We love oh, that. Man, Hazo sounds like such a cool character. We yeah, love that. He totally does. And I'm sure everyone's waiting to know how they can get Hazo. But of course, like Gene, Hazo new. will be available oh. via a new event wish in the early part of there version 2.8. And speaking of cool characters, Kazuha, Klee, and Yoimiya will also be making a return in their very own event wishes. And, and then finally, Sizo, okay. travelers can look forward to Hazo's very own hangout event. Nice. If you'd like to join Hazo in being a detective for a day, then you definitely <laughs> should check this out. Oh, I will. <laughs> Must stay strong. Right. Well, primo. it seems like we've covered everything we both, in Klee this bubble. Oh, Next shoot. we have Oh shoot. Must stay strong. Oh, it looks so pretty. Zinian. Right? This oh, is the a background. scene from the all new summertime Odyssey event. Mmm. Oh, I really like how bright that and looks open it cool. is. So pretty. <laughs> oh, and do you see the flowers on the ground? What's with those? Salbado oh, flowers. Cool. I don't know. And uh maybe it's like some kind of mechanism or something. Yeah. Oh. So That's this part is connected with Shinyan. If you remember the preview oh. image we saw at the start of the program, the island area has some secret connections it's to each of the characters that were shown there. Nice. Mm. Okay, well, let's see what happens when you interact with this instrument. Oh, dude, this is creative. It looks like it created a wind current or something. <laughs> it most certainly did. <laughs> doing After no doing no damage. the wind current oh, and never. lighting up, your plunging attack will deal considerable damage, which I think is going to come in pretty handy throughout oh, yeah, this that, challenge. That is Gene's hmm. skill, it literally. It appears that travelers can choose an instrument to trigger the desired effect. So keep that in mind to quickly defeat enemies. Yep, put them down. Oh, okay. Man, Lament. this place feels like a real combat zone. And judging from the surrounding area, I guess we'll need to use these mechanics to complete the challenge. It's real oh, orange. Yeah. And in such an open area, travelers can quickly test out a variety of effects. Hmm. They don't show four stars on the nice screen. Nice work. <laughs> so we'll receive some items What's which that? can be used in the event shop to exchange for goods. Once yes, you've another event shop. Items, Let's go. You can invite Fischl to join your team. Yeah. Hey, I mean, it never hurts yeah, free, to have another Fischl. Fischl on your team. And if you invite her, you know Oz is going to be there right beside her. Yep, what about Mona? Right. <laughs> 
In addition to domains, the Summertime Odyssey event will also feature a sailing game mode. Fun. Nice. That's oh, there's some green spheres on the course. Can you tell us about what those do, Zach? Totally. Those are energy orbs. Travelers can use an ability to help them collect more. Sumeru oh, orbs. Oh, I see. So after collecting Much a few orbs, orbs, it looks oh, like another no. ability is charged up. <laughs> Oh, cool. It's a Whoa, speed nice. burst. <laughs> wow, you can even break through obstacles. I'm sure that's, that's a good way to make some shortcuts. So, can you break through everything on the course? Kind of, yeah, for Amy. Uh, oh, no. No, it seems there are still some obstacles you cannot get through. Yeah. That's yeah, unfortunate. So some obstacles will require timing, and others are too strong to break through. Five nice. restart orders. All right, let's see no, how sure, long my current it took to my get three to the finishing accounts. point. Dang. Not too bad. Hmm. Nice. Summertime Odyssey bad. will also feature tons of other content and storylines for travelers to explore. So, be sure to check it out. Get some right, crystals, a crown, tons of new content, same old, same old. So, I think it's about time for another quick break. Yep, which means it's time for another Redemption Code! What, what? Redemption Code! Alright, I do like the shop format they have here, like the last one we had. There's Klee. Let me move. All right. Let's dive into what other events travelers can expect to see from the beautiful island area. First on the list is a challenge event called Reminiscent Regiment. What's unique about this one is that it will be a, a boat specific event. Ooh, nice party yes. time. Oh what? yeah. The event will include multiple different game modes, so we'll start with the one called Convoy. This is the second co-op specific event. Fine. Oh, shoot. Okay, so it looks like we have a pretty big raft here. What the heck? It's adorable. It is, right? And so the goal of Convoy Bear is revenue. to protect the vessel to its destination. Let's do this. Nice. Here we go. Ah, uh, and of course there are hilly trails attacking that we're gonna need to take care of. <laughs> Help right. me, Mark. Help me. Oh. <laughs> I'm right there by your side, buddy. <laughs> Wow. Uh, and I guess there are some barriers that are blocking the way. Uh, it seems we'll need to destroy them to clear a path for the raft. Right, and it looks, looks like the cool, raft's actually. energy is continuously dropping, so we need to collect these glowing coins to recover energy. Mm. Gotta be quick on your feet or quick with the wings. And yes, we're on the way again. <laughs> <That> is... <laughs> oh, hey, ether fell in the water. The brand Hydro new travel. event area? The oh, event oh, yeah. <laughs> Co -op a it looks mission. like you're gonna need Poggers. to be more careful and avoid falling in. Being a bird Don't has fall. its benefits, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is a lot to handle, and we have to glide everywhere. But it seems we've managed Animal to traveler. reach the destination. Yay! Oh, and he died. Okay. You know, actually, it's a lot of fun to participate in co-op games where people have to work together. You know, that mm -hmm. team spirit. You yeah, have totally. to work together. In addition to this game mode, we'll also have two other modes called raid and descent. Yes. In Raid, we'll need to navigate your Wave Rider and board floating platforms to battle opponents. Mm -hmm. oh, and it seems like we'll a need a boats. way to fly. So travelers will have to sail through all the marked locations before the wind currents will activate. <gasps> and finally, in Descent. Travelers will start from a platform high in the sky and battle their way down. Let their way down. Yep. I love flying and battling my cool. way down. Yeah. <laughs> bow, bow. That's right. <laughs> opponents on the next floating platform will only appear in a while. once you have cleared the Scary. opponents on the current floating platform. I yeah, work alone. I have a feeling that this event is going to lead to a lot of ridiculous moments between teammates. Yeah, yeah it is oh, interesting. Sure. sure. Totally. <laughs> you stole Jinx, my... you owe me another soda. No, I have no <laughs> sodas to give. Anyways, I hope everyone will enjoy these cool co-op events. Woo! And I... I hope everyone has their gliding license up to date. Ooh. They're having too much fun. <laughs> okay, now that we've covered the challenge event, let's have a look at another event coming to the island area called Resonating Visions. Ooh. No. Uh, cool. Okay. This event will bring some familiar vibes for experienced players who explored the islands last year. That's right, we'll be searching for... What? What just happened? Bro, this might be the most scuffed live stream they've had yet. <laughs> what? I said, I'm not watching a VOD. I didn't go back. What's the chat saying? <laughs> Look at the chat. 
<laughs> Look at the chat. The chat is just like just all doing this. They're all molding. Oh my god, dude. Wow. I think next time, I think we just watch the video. <laughs> After it's said and done. Holy moly, man. God dang. And, just like last time, this event will also be giving players the opportunity to unlock a new outfit. Oh. Care to guess what? who's getting a new outfit this time? Just say it. Not you. <laughs> no, it's okay. Fischl! That's right, in version 2.8, Fischl will well, be getting an all-new one. outfit. Ah, yay! Woohoo! <laughs> uh, oh, that crown nice. is every... And, just like last... ...tain different pieces of... ...last year. That's like somebody's right, we'll like skipping through it. What is going on? Stories again. Oh, nice. Totally right, fit for a princess. Up. And look at her red eye. I don't know if you guys noticed that. No way. <laughs> What's going on there? Yeah, you know, I don't know. I guess you're going to have to play to find out. And after completing the requirements in the event, travelers will be able to snag the snazzy new outfit for free. Just yeah, got to grind for him. We to go back. You see that name of that one? Oh my god. In addition to the island events, version 2.8 will oh. also be featuring a variety of other updates. Mm-hmm. Too bad I don't have D-Luke. D-Luke will also be receiving a new outfit, which will nice. be available to purchase in the shop. Red Travelers Dead of can Night. learn the backstory behind the outfit, that looks which is cool. super cool, by playing through the Hidden Stripe Challenge event. I am living for that ponytail. That looks like a whole <laughs> different <laughs> game. The new hair, sharp tails looks epic. Looks that like red Tower of Fantasy. color scheme is awesome. <laughs> yeah. So a ponytail. Good. And as a matter of fact, this will be the game's first ever five star outfit. Wait, but we already have outfits for Jean and Kutching, though. Right, but this yeah, we outfit do. itself is five stars. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. Gotcha. Gotcha. What? Yep. So let's take a look at what travelers can expect to see in the Hidden is, Stripe event. Is there going to be more money so then? It looks like we can try out D Luke's new outfit. Looks pretty cool. Yeah. Five star oh, outfit. So the costume has some new effects for D Luke. Indeed, it does. There's even a new idol animation included with this costume, and it's pretty oh, sweet. Oh, really? The heck I don't is see D Luke's vision anywhere on this outfit. Huh. So uh, does he Dang. keep it in his pocket, or maybe it's tucked away somewhere else? <laughs> That's interesting. Um, don't look at me. Uh, I didn't know that. It looks like there will be lots of backstory to go along with the outfit. So. Be sure to check that out. Interesting. So, in addition to like the backstory 50 bucks. content, what kind of challenges can travelers Looks expect? Too broke for the skin, yeah. Well, it'll be similar to the Phantom Flow event that we've had before, with a variety of set objectives for travelers to reach. So, after oh, completing an objective, a special after-imaged might effect will be unlocked, which will add buffs for the next battles. Nice. That would be fun. Next version 2.8 will have an event a that's whole new all animation. about and components. It's called Evermotion Mechanical Painting. Sweet. Oh, boy. Boy. Puzzles. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this one looks really Love interesting. Puzzles. <laughs> hmm. Love puzzles. Love so puzzles. If it wasn't copium, I would buy a skin. Like we need to take the components yeah, and place them on this mechanical board. What yeah. are you going to do? All right. Yeah. So I guess like in terms of uh, how many outfits they release for characters, it makes sense that D-Look is getting one or my set characters are getting them because they don't really release outfits too often at all. So. They kind of have some catching up to do. <laughs> How was your first special program? Uh, oh, it was the first I'm one. Oh. All right, and uh, that just about does it for today's special. Out for future official announcements to get more information on version 2.8. <laughs> and that's. Oh my god. No Subaru comes? What? No Subaru, nothing. And then also, did it just. Freeze. See you in game. Later, y'all. Bye, Bye, guys. <laughs> Bye. Holy moly. That might have been the most scuffed live stream they've had. Yeah, I don't know what happened. I, mean, I don't know if it was on Twitch's end. I don't know what happened there, but my goodness. It didn't even end properly. What was that? I don't know what's happening because it's still buffering. Also, can't click on anything. I don't know what's going on. Is that it? Is it over? Simru sneak peek will be 2.9. No, the pre Simru Chris. 2.9? Oh, God. There's no way there's a 2.9. There's no way. I didn't even see my mouse anymore. I took my mouse away from me. 
The page wouldn't even reload. This page isn't responding. Like, holy crap, man. What is going on? Everybody stream times this me. There is no fucking way <laughs> they're going to restart it. Wait a minute. They're restarting? They went live. They went huh? live. We're good. Do you say you're a traveler? We're good. Wait, what? Well, then. Maybe Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Wait, 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 what is this? What? What is happening? Oh my god. Huh? Who is in charge of this of today's stream? What is going on? They're online, they're offline, they're online, they're offline. What are we doing? Live stream may have to be put too much effort on Twitch servers, so it's probably had a bad effect on the whole site. Oh. Okay, okay. Oh, shoot. Oh my god, bro. That looks so good. Reminds me of like the Shantae games. What is happening? Oh, <laughs> oh it's, it's, they're too they're too popular, man. They're breaking Twitch. Oh, it's a bear heart. Yeah, it's yeah. It, it, the stream already happened. I guess if you want to call it that, it's been it's been a it's been a ride. Yeah, that that was Sumeru, I think. And then I guess the day was that at the end of the stream or. I don't know. Here we go. Here is looks like from China. Looks like or Japanese or Japan. We have the Sumeru trailer. Here's the crumbs that we were supposed to see, but apparently uh, the internet is having some trouble today. So, boom. That's gonna be annoying to climb. That gets me excited right there. That looks so good. That looks so good. Debated. What is this? Find me a crystal, crystal flowers there. Or fireflies. Oh my god. Wow. I love the foresty vibe of that. Yeah, that reminds me of like Shantae, um, like the the Shantae games. It's like a, that's like an old classic game, but the music, the atmosphere, the environment. I also wonder, is there gonna be like a a desert, a desert lo location? Maybe doesn't look like it because they didn't show it. Yeah, there it is. So it's very uh very vertical, very uphill. I was thinking it was gonna be like a flat ground, but that's that's better. Here we go. Have you ever met someone by the name of Kaedahara Kazuha? He was called away earlier by some people from the Tenryo Commission. They said they had something it's to discuss with him. Since the Vision Hunt decree has been repealed, I no longer have any grounds to officially arrest him. Then again, I guess something very interesting is about to happen. Mm. I need to really That's see it. it. I'm taking this case over. Looks good. Ooh, you said people are flying with that? touched the hilt for the first time. It's as if I was transported to a strange dimension. Oh, See, this potatoes. looks freaking cool, man. Yeah, what is this? Paradise that one has been searching for. That looks so Here good. Is where we shall witness the culmination of all things. Oh, there's Beto's boat! Shall lead you to yonder gate of dreams. I didn't even see Mona last time. Be to the princess who 
has led us here to this sacred place. My sincere gratitude to you for inviting me to join you on this trip, Your Highness. Look at me, a genius astrologist <laughs> forced into a juvenile role-playing game. No, no. Magistus, are you embarrassed? Stop calling me that weird name. Lady Magig... What? <laughs> <laughs> excellent, most excellent. What is this? That's enough. Come on, just play along. Oh, that's gonna be funny, man. For Shil and Mona in the same quest. Zinnia's kind of funny, too. That was much better to watch uh, in, in its entirety instead of the constant lag. I didn't even see Mona the first time. So that must be like a new domain or something, that giant Fischl area. Like, that was that was cool. Holy crap, what was that? Oh, these are all the enemies that are like in the boat stage, or is this another one? The Red Dead of Night. That's actually a really, I like how they changed the hair too. And he's holding the wolf's gravestone. Nice. So hopefully, I I hope what happens here is with more um, seasonal events, we get more outfits. But yeah, I did not think they was going to have a whole five-star outfit. I didn't, th I didn't know that was a thing.